Welcome to Off Grid with Dave and Sonia. I'm Dave, and today we're going to see how much power it takes to recharge this lithium battery for the Ryobi cordless tools. So let's get started. So the test I want to do today is I want to charge this battery with two chargers. The one charger is an AC charger. So it's a Ryobi charger, but it's got the AC plug on it. And the second charger I want to use is the DC charger. So it charges the same battery, but it plugs into a cigarette lighter. I don't have a way to measure how much power I use from the cigarette lighter. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to charge this using the Blue Eddy. And I'm going to use the kilowatt meter like we have been. And we'll see what the total watt hours it took to charge a battery through here. But I will also see what is the percentage I used on the Blue Eddy. Then when I charge with a DC, I'll plug it into the cigarette lighter. And then I will see what the percentage is I used on the Blue Eddy. So then, one, I can tell if I used more or less power with the DC charger. But I should be able to extrapolate with math how much power I actually did use. So let's get started. We turn on the display. We'll turn on the AC side. Green light. I will reset the meter because I can't reset it once I plug in the, the AC charger. It covers up the buttons. I got a red light. There's nothing in there yet. I'll start charging it. It does some checks and stuff, and then it'll it'll start flashing it, saying it's charging. So I started with this unit fully charged. So I'll make sure when we charge a second time on the other charger that I do the same thing. It's fully charged. I also just drain this battery today, and I will do the same thing after I charge it. I'll make sure I drain it using the same tool and then we'll charge it up in this one. So we'll come back when this battery is charged and we'll see how much power we use. So this just finished charging. So we have 54% left on the Blue Eddy. So we use 46% to charge. And it's still drawing five watts of power. And the light is still on. So I'm gonna unplug it. So now we can see what the kilowatt meter says. We can see the blue eddy is 54%. And let's see what the meter says. If I would have used it on the house utilities, it would have cost one cent to charge. 20 cents is my rate. 0 0.08 kilowatts or 80 watt hours. So that's what it's used. So next I'll drain this battery and then we'll run the experiment again with the DC charger. So I drain this battery. So now we're ready to charge it with the 12 volt charger. So let's turn on the DC side of the Ueti. DC's on. Plug that in. Okay, so it's charging now. And I'm using 62 watts. The other one was using 68 watts. So we'll see how long this takes to charge and we'll see what the percentage is remaining when it's done charging. So we'll come back. So we just finished the second charge cycle of the same battery. And the second test used only 39% on the Blue Eddy. So this was more efficient than the AC version of the charger. So in summary, we used 67 watts with this charger. With this one, we used 80 watts. It took two hours with this one. It took an hour and 27 minutes with this one. So this one's also quicker. This one drew less wattage while it was running. I believe it was 62 watts. This one was using 68 watts while it was running. So this one used more wattage while it was running, plus took longer. This one used less wattage, was quicker. So overall, 
it used 10 to 15 watt hours less, 67 watts total, watt hours total. It would be better to go DC instead of AC when using the, the Blue Eddy. Uh, it will give you more charge cycles. You have to recharge it less often with the solar. So at 67 watts, I would get at least three charges, if not four. Uh, four would be cutting it pretty close, so maybe three and a half before I need to recharge this. If we needed to extend the use of this, I could probably recharge an infinite amount of these throughout the day if I left the solar panel plugged in. So the solar panel is a 100 watt panel. It's charging, I'm only using 68. Um, I could in theory use this and not deplete this at all during the day. So if you like videos like this, subscribe up here and watch more videos down here. Have a good day.